Yeah, I am. I think no one disputes that Mare Cantonucci is a is a very talented player. And uh, when you've got a focused uh, Merkel, you have a a player that you know will will have defenders not wishing to face. And um, it's the way he moved the ball for the, the first goal that really impressed me. No one gets us up the pitch, but I think the centre back didn't know if he was turning left or right or going straight on. It was almost a roundabout situation for him, and he played Big Sully in, who, who gets a lot of luck. But if you don't get a lot, you don't sometimes score a goal. And I think you have to look at with the absolute professionalism and a plume Merkel took the, the second goal he goes 60 yards up the pitch with it carrying it perhaps thinking defenders are going to come from nowhere they don't come the goalkeeper don't come and he makes the hardest job in football look the easiest job when he passes it into the far corner and when he plays like that you you know you've got a real player in your hands a lot of speculation linking him with a move away in the window um, out of contract end of the season Steve has anything happened there with respect to Merkel? Well I think we were here last week weren't we that's for others to, to focus on I just want as the head coach I want Merkel to focus on his performances I want him to focus on getting a, a lot more goals and I, I did have a chat with Merkel prior to the Bolton game and saying your time has arrived to go and score some goals and produce performances that that make you sought after both internally and externally and it's you know if he continues to score goals he puts himself in a wonderful position and he and he gives this football club every opportunity to want to have that kid around for now 12 months or two years whatever it takes mm -hmm. uh, but that, that decision ultimately lies with other people